is not the way to Waterland. I don't talk a lot when I'm watching stuff. No, I, don't. <laughs> I, I do. <laughs> 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 the busted. What happened? Oh, it's water. bubbles. Yeah, they're into bubbles. <laughs> what? Oh god! <laughs> Where everything is water! Even us! <laughs> Even us! <laughs> what the? Even us! Does she have Down syndrome? <laughs> <laughs> is it just me? Or is it getting really warm? Um, Miss Grizzle, what happens when water gets warm? <laughs> um, what? Apparently, <laughs> <laughs> the bus evaporates too. <laughs> I'm rising into the air! Bro, what, what's happening? Here? Evaporation, guys. No, it looks like they're high. Aren't they gonna die? Like, if they... <laughs> because physics. <laughs> Why does he matter to this story? <laughs> what is happening? Fuck? I remember reading the books too, but I don't remember the show. Oh, That's not how you <laughs> open the door! <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I totally guessed that. I don't know. <laughs> Made in China. <gasps> so interesting. It's just like. Made in China. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, seriously, you're gonna make that comment. Okay. <laughs> Is that a dragon? First we were a liquid, then we became a gas. Still won't like it. But if they died and they're all rising up to heaven, how come yeah. he's going? He's a ginger. He's, he's so hard. <laughs> Your water, that's when fine. When it's cold outside. When it's cold outside. What? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what? <laughs> that's gruesome. That's like a horror. Water is. Hey, I'm unvaporizing. Look at my hands. What the heck? <laughs> <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> what the heck? <laughs> Miss Frizzle is just like, yeah, I got this. <laughs> water is as water what is Miss Frizzle? No. She's not human. <laughs> Another clouds. I don't even know like who they are anymore. They're, they're just, just ducks. <laughs> they're just all white. <laughs> That's racist. <laughs> Fantastic. <laughs> I could tell that guy was the ginger guy. Didn't even have to see his color, he's just ginger. <laughs> Wherever we're going, it looks to be like it's not our choice. It's not our choice. <laughs> That's the they're being like taken against their will on this whole like journey Take it, and they're just edition. like so gleeful about the whole thing. This is terrifying. This is like, is this for kids? In a word, Keisha. Yes! <laughs> what? Bad, 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 bad. Wherever we're going. alert, they're gonna rain down to the bottom. I called it. <laughs> we learned this in like second grade. Yes! Like, what do they go home and tell their parents? What must their parents think? Hey, hey mommy! Dad, we we went to turn me into yeah. a cloud. Yeah, um, is she giving you drugs, honey? Okay. Now, now it's not the video, and okay. watch the second one. Alright. Can I make the noise? Okay, wait, wait, wait. Build by the science guy. See, I'm in here. Build by the science guy. Yes! See, I'm in here. Build by the science guy. Oh, yeah. Right, yeah, go ahead. Should I clap? Oh, you don't have to. You don't have to. I do what I want. <laughs> Build by the science guy. See, I'm in here. I'm in this giant freezer. <laughs> oh, I'm in giant freezer. 
Okay. See the surface of the science guy. See the surface <laughs> of my uh, bubble helmet of science turns cloudy. That's because water vapor, which was floating around in the air, uh, sticks to the cold surface in little liquid water droplets called condensation. It's the same thing that happens to people who wear glasses when they come in after being outside on a cold day. It's where clouds come from. Where'd you guys go? <laughs> oh, funny. Oh, very funny. Yeah, very funny. <laughs> oh, we're in the point of view of a bunch of little kids. We're really small. It's creative, actually. Condensation to happen. Look at the glass. <laughs> I love these little things. <laughs> oh yeah, these. But it is wet. Condensation to happen. Look at the glass next time you drink your milk. Does it seem to sweat? What? <laughs> <laughs> Sweaty glass. Water vapor needs a place to stick in order for condensation to happen. Look at the glass next time you drink your milk. Does it seem to sweat? Well, the glass isn't really sweating, of course, but it is wet. It's just the water vapor. When clouds form, water vapor turns into tiny liquid water drops. But in order for that to happen, the water has to have some place to stick. So take a look at this. This is our big glass <laughs> cloud apparatus of science. We're going to make a cloud in here. First, all the sound we'll add effects. a little water. This, this is our big glass jug cloud apparatus of science. Science. We're gonna make a cloud in here. It oh yeah, Bill. <laughs> now, using this pump, we'll pressurize. Pump that water, Bill. Jug. Pump that water. And when I pull this rubber stopper off, the air in the jug will expand. Three, two, one. See ya. Uh, Do you see that? Cloud? Nothing happened. No. <laughs> That's because the water. Two. What? See, uh, nothing happened. <laughs> the water anything to stick to. So what we're gonna do is add some dust, just a tiny amount of dust, and to make and to make the dust, we'll use the smoke from these two matches. That's all the dust we need. That's not dust. That's smoke. That's threw. all the dust we need to form a cloud. <laughs> just threw a couple matches in. I think we'll that's pressurize smoke. pressurize it again. Three, two, one. There we See? go. It's a cloud. Three, I forgot how much I'm about Bill Nine. What? Me too. See? It's a cloud. It's the water <laughs> cycle. It's science. Science. <laughs> Three, two, one. See? It's a cloud. It's the water cycle. It's science. <laughs> that water. Two, one. Oh, there you go. See, it's a cloud. In the it's past two minutes, cycle. I've learned more about science it's than in the past semester. Science. <laughs> science. For the glory of science, of course. Okay, now the third tap, which is a little game that you guys have to play. Okay. Continue. <laughs> Drag and drop all the pictures to complete the water. We got this. We got this, Bernard. Water is all around us. There is water in seas, rivers, lakes, ponds, and clouds, and even in the air. Did you just skip it? Yes. It evaporates. Clouds. The clouds. The clouds. Yeah, no, but what does this say? Water? Okay, no, that's the last one. No, that's, yeah. That's that one goes there. That one goes there. All right, now that one goes. Next. We did it! Yes! And then this one. It's a touch screen. Chill. No. <laughs> I forgot about that. That's right. The sun warms the bodies of water. It's like river. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Wait, what does that mean, though? No, like when... Oh, uh, okay. Okay, so like, that would be the last uh -huh. one. Okay, because then it rains, water falls from the clouds. Uh -huh. Yeah. That's right. <laughs> <laughs> you can only put it one place. Yeah, it looks like it. Anyway, water falls. Water cut. Oh. Okay, I'm going to restart this. This is the same guy who thought the 50s were the 80s. Just to put some perspective out there for you. <laughs> Stop, okay. Click on each stage of the water cycle to explore it. Evaporation! It looks like a sauna. <laughs> <laughs> no! Yes! There you go. There you go. Done. What? Oh! Oh! Mm. Mm. At least oh. I know my timelines. Okay, um... 
Are we done? Yes. <laughs> How was that a game? <laughs> it's on interactive media. Okay. All right. We learn about we the sat water down cycle. We and did our friend's experiment thing, helping out, because we're good people. You're lucky to have us. First, we watched a Magic School Puzzle video, um, where they, they turned, teach how, how they like went through this weird process. Water cycle. Yeah, the water cycle. They went through this process, and they turned the kids into water, <laughs> which if you think about it, is pretty creepy. But then we watched Bill Nye the Science huh? Guy. Bill Nye is cool. Yes. Yeah. And we play, well, it, it was not a game, we... Yeah, it, Chino, um, I mean Daniel. Daniel said it was a game. It wasn't a game though. Don't be fooled. About evaporation for different methods of what media, video, media, video. visual, and Bill games. Nye. So what did you just watch? <laughs> yeah, yeah. What did you just? Do? Oh, seriously? Well, we just watched A Child's Way of Learning About the Water Cycle. And yeah. then we watched Build Night, a science guy, explain it. I, I, I felt like I was high in the first video. Yeah, in the first video you felt on drugs, dude. It's like, okay. we're water! So, have you ever watched any of these videos, series, or like... I've watched both of them. I have read the books of, um... The Magic School Bus, but I don't remember um, watching the series. Although I do remember watching Bill Nye the Science Guy as a kid. When I was a kid, Magic School Bus every morning, and then Bill Nye the Science Guy was sixth grade, seventh grade, and eighth grade. B Bill Nye was science class history in middle school, and I'm a fan of this little Magic School Bus clip in specific. <laughs> but yeah, I used to read the books when I was little. And the game, uh, the game. Flat out. To be honest, like, I never watched Bill Nye as a kid. Like, also, I never watched Bill Nye. I just knew about him. And the only reference I ever knew about Bill Nye was about from a friend. We called him Toshi, the science guy. Yes, I Bill have Nye. experienced some interactive media similar to that before, in which uh, you did basic, like, matching and stuff like that. But it, it was pretty basic in terms of, like, good. Uh, I already watched Bill Nye, the science guy, before. Yeah, me too. Bill Nye the Science Guy is cool. And also Magic Thanks. School Bus. This is Frizzle. Um, which one of these were your favorite as fun? In terms Bill of Nye the Science Guy. Fun? I'd say Magic School Wait, Bus. What, what in terms of learning or enjoyment? Enjoyment. Oh, in terms of the enjoyment, enjoyment Magic, the, 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 School the, the, the Magic School Bus. <laughs> the game was not fun. Gosh, outside. was that even a game? Bill Nye. Bill Nye. Bill Nye. Well, depends. H how old? The kids to be. No, even if the kids like, are like, if, if it's our, our age, Nye. probably Bill Nye, because no, even Magic the younger school, ones. Magic school. Well, yeah, bus. but there's a limit. Like, you won't give it to a three-year-old and expect them to be able to sit through the whole I thing. But Magic School Bus, it's like to give whole now or snow to like a three-year-old. I'd rather like show them something that's fun and gives them, you know, the message. Hooba hooba hooba! Bill Nye, the science guy. That's, not, that's how it starts. The song. No, but like I, he made a part that was like hooba hooba hooba. <laughs> which was I would weird. say yeah, Bill Nye because it's like it's funny but not stupid. It's random but not like too try hard. No, like too like far away from the topic. Like you, you're still in the topic, but it's like you are making some weird jokes that so most of us find really cheesy. So okay, I'm currently researching about um. Different, three different types of educational media. The first one was a story-based media, the second one was the teacher-based media, and the third one was a, a mini-game. So what do you guys think it's the best for learning? Bill and I, because the mini-game is not, uh, you, you don't feel immersive. Aside from that, it's like the mini-game felt like, okay, I basic stuff, move on to the next question, that's about it. But then the school was felt like, yeah, it's good, but it's like distracting at the same time. For learning, Bill. Nye. Bill Nye, because he tells you what's going on. He doesn't just say, Ho! Oh, now we're water! Ho! Oh. No, no, no. Bill Nye's like, This is happening because this, 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 and that. And the game's just like, You figure it out yourself, nothing. And then, yeah. So, Bill Nye. Uh, I have the three visuals Bill Nye the Science Bill God. Nye the Science God. The well, then again, wait, wait, wait. <laughs> then again, but, like, what Bill Nye did was. He did like an actual experiment and showed, you know, no, a legitimate thing. No, what, no, but like I what Miss Frizzle did was, 
I mean, it was sh- she show us the cycle. I mean, she explained us the cycle of like how it all starts in a weird kind of crazy way. Uh, but I mean, yeah, I will stick with Bill Nye because he made us, he shows like a different experiment about like you know, how you form clouds and I mean, he used matches. <laughs> well, it, I think it really depends because one of the most important aspects of education is keeping the audience interested. Yes. So, like, I feel like the Magic School Bus video had its benefits, but also Bill Nye Science Guy had its benefits. Because, like, the teacher video, he was able to, you know, tell you everything you need to learn. It was really clear, and you could, you know, just get the information. But with Magic School Bus, it made it more interesting, and you could have to, you'd sort of have to, like, uh, it depends on the audience you're having. Yeah. I mean, not, not just that, but it would also, like, with Magic School Bus, you would sort of have to interpret what they were doing and go, oh, that's because, like, that and all that. I feel like it gave a better illustration of what was going on. Like, when they, like, started floating up, I was able to go, oh, you know, they're evaporating and all that. It would give the audience an idea. For, like, um, I feel like the Magic School Bus would be better for visual learners. And, like, Bill Nye, the science guy, had visuals because, like, he had the, the tube thing with the water in it and it turned into a cloud. But like, you can't really apply that to real life quite as well as it actually being a cloud. The interactive media thing was bad. Yes. It was really bad. Uh, but I think that, I think that interactive media is a good idea, just that this interactive media was really bad. Yes. Eddie, if you could not work, I'm well, sure to give an answer. Season 2, episode 6. Question <laughs> What did you learn about evaporation? So what did you just watch? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Oh, seriously? Wow.